Hey, what's up? It's Christopher Drew, and you are watching PETA2.com. Well, I came to this realization that I felt like shit, and I was just vegetarian. I was still eating things um, uh, like cheese occasionally and eggs occasionally. I took a road trip with my buddy out to California, or a couple of us went out there. We got a house in Santa Monica, and then we just dove into just healthy eating healthy eating and we didn't eat anything cooked or processed or you know we went to all raw food spots ate all just fruits and vegetables straight started juicing and I felt like before every time I was eating I was dying more every time that I ate and now every time I eat I feel like I'm growing and still growing at 21 and that's insane vegetarian it started out as a trend you know a lot of people were doing it so I was just like I'm hopping on that shit you know that's cool fuck yeah and uh, but then as time went on I, I I really didn't realize for a long time why I was doing it, you know? Because I love animals, yeah, sure. But really, I'm doing it for myself. I'm doing it for my health. And uh, that's what I realized. And since I've had that mindset of, I will only put in food into my body that's medicine, because your food is your medicine. It's either your medicine or your fucking poison. If I only put medicine into my body, then I'm gonna live till I'm 115. And that's what I wanna do. I wanna look young until I'm 40, and then start getting gray hair at 60, and then at at 100, look like I'm 70. Raw vegan, it's, I mean, it's, it's, it's the only way to really feel good. I mean, the reason why things are so cheap in the fast food industry is because everyone eats there and because all the money's going into that. So the more money they have, the cheaper they can make it, the bigger the machines they can get to process the shit. And it's just gets grosser and grosser every day. I guess the fact that people just don't see, they're so blinded. That's what blows my mind about it. They're so blinded that they can't see exactly what they're eating and they can't understand that it's fucking disgusting. The best advice to say is just uh, start out with changing your taste buds. Letting your taste buds adapt to new flavors. Starting out just by eating a big old fat rock carrot, the whole thing, and just loving it, you know? And uh, and then diving into, uh, what's, what's a fruit that's kind of odd? Like a pomegranate, you know what I mean? Where you have to pick out all the seeds and then, you know? Like just little things like that. And then you start realizing that it's more fun to eat real food. Discover true health, discover the fantastic feeling of actually being in shape, of actually eating right, of actually making conscious decisions whenever you eat. For more information, visit PETA2.com.